hi everybody welcome back to my channel thank you to stop by if you're new here welcome my name is ashley jalford i post video about fashion beauty and lifestyle so we are back with a beauty content okay so this video as you can see i can't look the same like my last video because i decided to do it in different two video different so it will not be like very longer okay this one i will be talking how i bright lighting my bikini area if you have the, you have the same problem like me you have the same problem like me this may help you again i'm not like a specialist or doctor or beauty advisor no but this way works for me it may work for you so if you want to hear more smash that subscribe button and let's start the video now If you didn't, I will leave the link somewhere here so you can watch or in the description down below. I talk about how I stop like uh, having ingrow hair and uh, bumps, you know, those kind of things. So if you use that step and then you go to the other step is how to bright your bikini area because all those bumps and ingrow hair, when they dry out, they leave that dark spot. The dark, that darkness on your skin, the dark spot, what now we want to get rid of, okay? So, as I told you, the first thing before you may, you have to make sure to use those, this way, those stem, first you need to shave. Like, if you don't shave, it will be very difficult for the product to uh, be more like react if i can say in your skin so you have to have like that smooth and um, clean area so you can use the powder and it will be more effective okay so uh if you didn't see my last video i talked about how i i, I shave now to stop having more so you can watch that video and you will continue this one okay so after shaving like what waxing and the laser is a good way but laser is expensive, so I'm using the Brazilian for my sensitive. I'm very sensitive in my bikini area. This is the only thing that works for me. So since I've been using it and uh, all of this stuff, okay. So you have to make sure you are, you shave. And uh, the second part, I will be telling you the, the step, okay. After shaving, as I told you in my last video, you need to exfoliate. I told you all the product I use or how I do my product to exfoliate. So here also, I will begin by exfoliate and uh, you will find the product in my last video. So here I will be telling you more like the product I use to bright my bikini area, okay? How I'm using it and uh, how it works, okay? This may take time, you have just to be consistent it will not like brightening in a one night or one day in two days. It depends of skin and uh, this area sometimes is like more like um, not very easy to light. So you have to be very consistent. I've been using sea salt, which I will show you all of those things in the picture. You see, I've been using sea salt. I've been using papaya and coconut oil and... Um, aloe vera lemon yes i use lemon not lime lemon papaya helps the papaya helps to light your skin is very good uh for lighting skins and most of the you see exfoliate like product and that papaya uh, ingredient and then you have sea salt as i told you it really helps like to clean your skin uh, like uh, remove those dark uh, those dead um, skin like uh, is also good is also good for improving the glowing of the skin removing all the um, how i can say i don't know how to say it in, in english impurity 
in your your skin it's really good and also we have aloe vera which is very good like for healing skin uh, healing the skin is good for scars mark dark spot pigmentation this is very good also we have coconut oil which is very good like for moisturizing leave that soft and glowing skin you know it's really good and we have lime and uh, lemon not lime lemon also is very really good is a good um, ingredient for lighting the screen lighting your skin your skin uh, remove all those dirty on your skin the lemon is really nice so I mix that and um, I put it in a bowl which I've been using like two times uh, a week like I'm trying to use it like three, four times, but I'm using it three times a week, and it really works for me to light that area. Again, I say you have to really be uh, consistent. It will not happen like in one night. So first thing is like exfoliate. It's really really nice. I also see that tea tea tree. It's really nice. Also like a cleanser before like or after. Uh, before to exfoliate or after you can use a tea tree also to prevent like dark spots and uh, in grow air and also to remove those dark spots not to prevent to remove the dark spot the tree tree tea tree cleanser will be nice for you and uh, after doing that like this one really works i will just explain you so i will show you those what i'm talking about and it really helps and uh, first of all we have turmeric it's really nice like that this product is really nice when i'm saying it's nice it's nice so it's height it's height on color okay this turmeric because it's like yellow or orange so it will be very very efficient if i can say on your skin so what I do, I use turmeric powder, organic or I don't know, you can use what you have, and I use apple vinegar, apple cider vinegar. All of those things, I use it like half a spoon, okay? Or it depends, you can use all spoon, it depends, you can keep it like for the next day if you already mix it. I use apple cider and I use lemon, which is good, as I say, for lighting your skin and uh, it, helps, or it helps also to get rid of bacteria the lemon is very good i use baking soda and um, the baking soda also can uh, can uh, work like exfoliate in your skin so it's also good and uh, use this cream whipping cream I saw in one video the girl use it to light her uh, underarm. So this is good also to use for a bikini area and uh, inside of your um, thigh. This will be nice. So I will put all of those things uh, in the in the screen so you can see. So I mix it and I use it like three times a week. Okay, it's not like light light, but it's getting there. So I keep it like for 15 minutes when I apply, I keep it 15 minutes uh, when I'm on the shower and then I clean. And then I wash it down and clean after I, because this is how me I'm using it. I exfoliate first with something that can really help me to get rid of dirty and then I use this. There is other people that just use this and finish so me i found the good way it was this way like doing it separately okay and i will put in the description each uh first step what i use and the second step what i use so this is works for me so the thing i wanted to say because the turmeric is really colorful i use it sometimes and the thing is every time the color go to your underwear okay it may change the underwear of your the color of your under i don't know if it happened for everybody but me it happens like if you wear like a white underwear or colorful like lighting color and then on the day if you sweat you come back and you can see the underwear that uh, yellow or orange color the, the the day you use that uh, you apply that i think it's better you wear like 
a black underwear will be better just in case so the other thing also i learned is uh, and say if you have like tie uh, big tie like you know it's like every time you walk is like uh, i don't know how i can say touching each other this is the thing can make your tie become very dark so the good thing is to wear something underneath like a shapewear like you know those shapewear you can cover your tight it's really good because more you walking and you sweating your tight um, you can it can irritate the area it can it, it can irritate the area and after the, this area is irritated we it will dry and leave that darkness so this also very important and this is the way also we get that darkness not only talking about the bikini area the bumps and the ingo hair but the t on the tie, I think this also can create, can bring that darkness. So better for you to avoid that uh, irritation because it can bring also um, darkness. So this is almost everything I wanted to say. And uh, yeah, so I really hope you enjoyed that video. Let me know if you try those those uh, ingredients if it works for you please let me know i would like to know it in the comment or if you are another way to do that i would love also try it and you can just leave it in the comment i'll be very happy to see that so i think it's all i see in this video please subscribe